Dear students, today's concept, if the sum of some non-negative numbers is 0, then each number should be 0. Basing on this concept, we will do one important sum. You see, suppose one equation given algebraic equation, solve x square plus x minus 132 whole square plus x square minus x minus 156 whole square plus x square minus 2x minus 168 equal to 0 whole square equal to 0. This one we have to solve. It seems to be very difficult. Why? Because here quadratic equation whole square is there. So, you will get a fourth degree equation. While solving fourth degree equation, so many things we have to use. But the concept is here, the sum of some non-negative terms are 0, then each number will be 0. You know that the square of any real number is non-negative. So, here three terms are there. All the terms have whole squares. So, all the three terms are non-negative. So, this implies first term x square plus x minus 132 whole square equal to 0. Therefore, that equal to 0. And second one x square minus x minus 156 equal to 0. Third one x square minus 2x minus 168 equal to 0. Now, you can solve by using splitting middle term. The factors of first one is x plus 12 into x minus 11. The factors of second one is x plus 12 into x minus 13 equal to 0. The factors of third one is x minus 40, x minus 14 into x plus 12 equal to 0. If you solve these equations individually, x equal to minus 12, 11. Second one, x equal to minus 12, 13. Third one, x equal to minus 12, 14. But all should be 0. That's why your answer will be x equal to minus 12.